you come across these steel masterpieces, all brought together in the most ingenious ways to produce more and more. Is this foreign? I say no. This is breeding 50 years ago. I spent days and months taking care of those birds in the pasture. The basics that I'm using today is passed from one generation to the next. It's a way of life rather than going to a factory producing protein units. There's no way you can love an animal that has been genetically engineered to die in six weeks. There's inherent cruelty in that system. I started documenting things I saw or things I heard about. It was time to pull the trigger. It's against federal law to have cameras. You can't shut down the individual's right to know about what this industry is doing. There's got to be a stop. There's no future in this method of raising food. So I believe you're going to see more traditional type livestock production. The demand is there. I think we're going to see massive shift over to the plant-based technologies. It's healthier and environmentally sustainable. If we're going to change the system, there needs to be a place for farmers to come and relearn this again. This is my mission, fighting to keep something alive. <laughs>